Hey guys, what's going on? This is going to be a pretty tired commentary, so if I sound a little different or if I sound, I don't know, scatterbrained, it's because I've been up for about 20 hours and I wanted to get one more video out for today just because tomorrow might be a little bit weird. Uh, I just want to get out a channel update, man. I haven't done a channel update in... Well, I used to hardly ever do these, but I, I like doing them just to give you guys a little bit of a hint of what I'm going to be doing next because I know I'm random. I like to post variety, and right now there hasn't been that much variety. I'll be honest, it's been... Zyback FPS for the last almost month. Just I mean, there's just some kick-ass first-person shooter games out right now, guys. Black Ops 2, ton of fun. It, it, apparently, it's like you know, it's like this taboo thing for people to have fun playing Call of Duty. It's like the worst game ever, according to all the the gaming hipsters and shit. But I'm having a lot of fun with Black Ops 2. I really am. So posting a lot of Black Ops 2. I just I don't know, man. I like it. Um, and Halo 4. Great game. Gonna be playing the shit out of that once I get a little bit more bored of Halo or of uh, Black Ops 2. And I don't know. It, they're both really good games. I'm more of a Call of Duty fan. That's why I'm playing a lot of Call of Duty. But I will inevitably get bored of Call of Duty and go back to Halo and switch it up. That kind of thing. Same thing with WoW and Guild Wars 2. So, uh, oh yeah, let's talk about the gameplay for a bit. This gameplay is from Shane, my roommate. A lot of you guys do not know. But Shane is a fucking beast. 96 and 3, playing solo, unbelievable. The gun he's using in this gameplay is the FAL Silenced Red Dot, and I believe Quick Draw. Or no, he doesn't even have. I don't even know if he has Quick Draw because he just. Pers yeah, he probably has. I don't even know if he has it on, but he doesn't have Primary Gunfighter. No, he he doesn't have it because he's only level 28. So he's using the Red Dot and a Silencer. Uh, I'm not sure what he's using. Fuck, never mind. I, I'm scatterbrained, but. 96 and 3. People don't realize that Shane is a beast. People are like, oh, does Shane play Call of Duty? What games has Shane played? Like, they just don't even know. They just don't even know. He's better than I. He's, he's probably the best Call of Duty player. One of the best in this area, for sure. So, I mean, this is the proof is in the pudding. This is playing solo. Normal kill confirmed. No bullshit. Just prestiged. Now, obviously, this is, one of, this is probably the best game he's ever played. But it's not, it's not, you get it mixed up. He doesn't just roll into games every, he doesn't just roll in and do this every game. But, pretty good player for sure. I think he's rocking about a 2 KD in this game, which is actually really good for this game. Uh, yeah, plays on a high sensitivity, a lot of fun to watch. You'll see uh, his, re his, I almost called it Reaper, his Lodestar. Jesus fucking Christ, is his loads. He's really good in those goddamn Lodestars, I'll tell you that. So, anyway, back on the channel update. Uh... Gonna be, so what I plan on working on tomorrow is I'm going to sit down, play all of Halo Force campaign. I, uh, I'm going to try to hit the gym for an hour. I've been I've been doing that a little bit more recently too. Uh, I need to, I've, uh, I've done it like three days in a row. What I always do is I'll, I'll go for like a week and it, I don't know. I, I sort of have an excuse with the games that have come out. You know, Halo 4 came out and then Black Ops 2 came out. Now I really have no excuses. I don't have any excuses. I need to go tomorrow. I'm going. If I don't go, there's no excuses other than me just being a lazy sack of shit. So, going to be doing that. Playing Halo 4. Going to be posting all that. I'm going to be posting a lot of videos. That's the main thing that I wanted to come on here and tell you guys. There's going to be a lot of videos. There's going to be a lot of Call of Duty gameplays. There's going to be a lot of tips and tricks. There's going to be a lot of uh, a lot of Call of Duty. There's definitely going to be a lot of Call of Duty. There's going to be, a, obviously, I, I like my Let's Plays to go quickly. And there's going to be a lot of that. Uh, Halo 4, once, hopefully, what I like to do is just sit down, especially with games, games with short campaigns, sit down and get all of the recording done, get the voiceover done, get the, uh, you know, just sit down and beat it all in one day. And then, release it over the next three days, and, and hopefully it won't take more than three days to get the whole Halo 3 Let's Play, or Halo 4 Let's Play done. I'm tired, man. I, I keep saying the wrong games. But, anyway, so that's my plan, my short-term plan. Long-term plan, uh, when patch 5.1 comes out, a lot of you guys want to know, what are you doing with WoW? Why is there no WoW? You just stopped all of a sudden. What happened? The game is just, eh. It's not very good right now. Like, let's, let's be fucking realistic here. Let's, let's be honest. The PvP in World of Warcraft right now is a fucking disaster. It's, it's terrible. So, and I, and I said that in my WoW videos where, where I said I was coming back to the game. I'm only playing it for 3v3 Arena. And right now, monks are irrelevant. The class in PvP is irrelevant. It doesn't even come up in the conversation. When you talk about WoW Arena right now, monks don't even 
register as something that people even talk about. So, I, I'm just it's not fun. So, 5.1 will change a lot of it for Windwalkers. Getting some pretty good buffs. Uh, the Tiger Palm buff. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. Even, I don't even know what's going on. I don't even know what's been reverted. What's been. Uh, what's been changed? I'm not even sure what's. I, I I need to go look on MMO Champion or something. But I I'll probably be playing a little bit more in 5.1. But you know I'm not gonna be doing strictly WoW. And if WoW is not fun, I'm not gonna play it. If Call of Duty isn't fun, not gonna play it. But uh, yeah, WoW. Uh, where was I going with this? Hmm, where was I going with this? So I'll be coming back to WoW at some point, maybe. I don't know. Same thing with Guild Wars 2. Guild Wars 2, I, I don't know what it is. I just don't want to play it right now. It, it, see, I don't feel like I'm... I, I always gave Dante and shit about the obligation thing. Like, I don't feel obligated to play Guild Wars 2. But it's kind of nice with there being no subscription fee. It's... I don't know. I can come back to it whenever, man. It's it's free to play. I don't have to... I don't have to, like, re-sign up. That's the thing that's fucking annoying about, like, subscription-based MMOs. I mean, I'm not rich by any means, but the 15 bucks a month isn't, like, a huge big deal to me. But having to re-sign up and redo that and re-put in your credit card and all that garbage, that sucks. But with Guild Wars 2, you know, it's free to play, so you don't have to worry about it. So, I don't know. You can just, you can bounce around. That's why I like it. I'll be playing Guild Wars 2 again. I will be I will be playing Guild Wars 2 again. I didn't, like, completely quit that game. I like that game. It's a good game. It's definitely a game that will compete with WoW, for sure. But, I just don't really feel like playing any MMOs right now. Just... Beasting up on the FPS. Look at this garbage. He went 96 and 3, and they still fucking lost. Look at those worthless, worthless teammates. How fucking. Oh my god, dude. I would have been so fucking pissed. 96 and 3, and you still fucking lose. How much can you suck to still lose when you go night? Oh my god. 5 and 32, 7 and 29. I can't, I don't even know what the stats of that guy that left the game. I'm sure there was probably two or three people that rage quit. They were just, god damn, how bad. Jesus fucking Christ. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the channel update, and I'll see you guys next time. Today I'm going to show you guys how to hear footsteps more clearly in Black Ops 2. It's a really simple audio option that most people probably overlooked. I know I did myself until Shane told me, like, holy shit, you got to check this out. It's in the presets. Now, most people probably looked at the presets and didn't think twice about it because you have headphone mode, Treyarch mix, bass boost, high boost. You just you look at that and you don't, you know, most people just...